Good morning. It is Friday, March 27th, 2020. And I'm coming to you for bed talk number six. That's right, bed talk. Not delivered on stage like a TED talk, but delivered from bed, where all us public speakers and similar likes are spending our time these days as we are isolating and taking care of ourselves and our families and all things around us. Today I want to talk to you about a gift that we've been given by this coronavirus. It's hard to see the gifts in the middle of it. There's many of them, but today I want to talk to you about the gift of time. The gift of time. The coronavirus situation has given all of us, both personally and professionally, a lot of time. Now there are certain people that are working harder than ever, and I honor their work. Certain areas that are still, you know, the, the um, first responder and the medical community and people in that arena. There are a lot of people working harder, but there's a lot of people right now with a lot of time. And whether these are, this is your own time or your team member's time, I want you to think about what are you doing with the time? And if your first response is, I don't really have a lot of time, take a look. Other than a few of us who actually have more on our plates right now, most of us have more time, but it'll slip away if you don't claim it. So think about what do you want to do with the gift of time? Here's a great one for your team members. And many of them are working remotely, but this can be done remotely. Training. Training is the one thing in your organization that most people or most companies will often say, we're too busy right now. We don't have time to do training. Not anymore. There are many companies out there right now who are struggling with the question of what do we do with our people? Do we lay them off? Do we have them go on unemployment? Are we still paying them? Their organization is still paying their people even if they don't have as much work to do because of the dynamics of the um, stay-at-home orders, etc. So maybe this is the time for training. What about those projects that have been on hold, whether it's a business project, a team project, or a personal project at home? One of those things that you keep saying, I've been meaning to get to that. Well, maybe now is the time to get to that. If it's in your business world, maybe this is the time to spend some time getting creative, putting together some new ideas that were in the back of your head, but move them to the front right now because you have less time needed right now to serve your clients and customers. All businesses are different. All our lives are different. All I want to remind you is that this coronavirus has given us all time. You know, one of the great things you can do with your time is get outside. I know it's tough being at home, but I'm not a doctor. But my, it seems to me that the, one of the safest places to be right now is outside in the fresh air. Go for a walk. Go for a bike ride. Go for a run. Whatever it is. It's not necessarily in a group. But what are you doing with your time? Are you spending more time with your family? Are you spending more time with your kids? Are you spending more time reading? You know, you've said, I really wish I read more. This is the time to grab a book. Get that book going that you've been sitting, it's been sitting on the shelf for a long time. We've been given some gifts here and we're facing challenges. I just wanna encourage you to pay attention to the gifts of time that we've all been given through this coronavirus situation and don't let that time slip through your fingers. That's what time does. And if you don't claim it, it'll slip away. So grab some time and do well with it. See you tomorrow.